afternoon and welcome to PQA News. My name is Polly Plastic. And I am Alfred Oyle. The apotheosis of a string of disappearances has led to the missing status of the famous movie star Gio Rosario Custodio. However, Have more... you seen this woman? You interrupted me. Three more have gone missing. In other news, the weather with Claudie Skye. Thank you, Alfred and Polly, for a mediocre news report at best. Now, my, I'm Claudie Skye to bring you something that you might actually use. There will be sunny skies uh, this morning uh, with a slight chance of clouds. Not that this is of any help to you due to this being the weather report for Albania. Uh, and also, where's my body? Well, where's my body? Someone's taken my body! Oh my god, I don't have a body! I don't know, I, I bet it was Polly! But she always wanted me. People will find out about this! You can't silence me! To conclude, it will be unusually hot for February. And I'm now going to pass back to my colleagues Alfred and Polly because I need to go and get my colleague a glass of water and a therapist. Oh, there's my body! And that's the weather for a country in the Balkans. In other news, the recent disappearance and consumption of the mayoral candidate's cake. Over to our team dealing with that. Mmm, cake. Thank you, Polly and Alfred. Today I'm here with... A tall Tom. And... Teeny Tilly. And you are the, the parents of Tiny... Tiny Tilly. Yeah. And he ate the Prime Minister's cake, correct? What? He no. didn't eat the cake. What's your favourite part of a Sunday dinner? Well, I mean, some mashed potatoes and some gravy. What about music? What's your favourite music? Well, I don't... You think he ate the cake? You think oh, my ooh, Timmy... Cake. What's your favourite cake? Oh, well, I mean, some chocolate at the bottom, some vanilla at the top, maybe some jam in the middle, you know? Like... Look, let's cut to the chase. Did your son eat the Prime Minister's cake? No. No, I mean, like, it would make more sense if you blame me for the... I mean, wait, but no, I didn't eat the cake. It's, it's, My it's son all. didn't eat the cake. I think it's ridiculous he's been accused of doing such a thing. Exactly. He's only five years old, and we've raised him way better than that. Exactly. <gasps> no. no, wait, it's it's all right. Just sit down. What? She's, she's gone now. See what you've done? Thank you. Back to Polly and Alfred. Thank you for that invigorating news report. Now... On to our next story, where there have been panicked reports of strange people living in bins. Over to our news reporter who is at the scene. Why can you not name him? We don't talk about that. Hello. Dave, you are answering a question. Are people safe from homeless people in bins? of parking cars. Built over the grave of Viking adventurer Jarl Bjorn Ironside, who famously traded 500 horses for the crown of England. Over to our reporter on the field, who will hopefully not be unearthing his remains, lest he return once more. Hello, today we're going to be showing you all the new 5000 Turbo Deluxe. Tesla made this new car and they're very proud to say it is built in leather seats, iPads in the back of the seat, and heated seats in the back and the front. Now, we hope you'll enjoy because now we are passing you on to Lyra. After talking about cars, we actually have a new car park and I will be asking the person who made it some questions. Hi. Hi. Uh, do you think this car park will be lasting? I feel like it will be uh, lasting because it's very like secure and it's very strong. Yeah, I don't feel like it's going to do anything and I feel like because of the spaces between the cars there's not going to be very a many accidents and like you know stuff like crashes and stuff oh, oh my god oh my god oh, oh. 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 o
how are you feeling? <laughs> sure. You said there'll be no accidents. What just happened to them? Oh my gosh. Oh. Um, over to our celebrity table, which will hopefully be much less dangerous. Why do we report this? We don't ask these questions at work, Alfred. So I'm here with Colleen and her bodyguard. First of all, before you start, could you um, sign my arm? I need to get a tattoo. Don't make it permanent. You don't okay. want a mistake in your life. Thank you. I'm a big fan. So, could you tell me about your new album coming out? My new album is called All About Me. How original. So, could you like sing your favorite song, like just a five second extract? Of course. My name is Colleen. I'm the best you'll ever see. Yeah, I'm the best you'll ever meet. Wow, I dress that's... the best, my hair's the best. Better than you could it's ever be. Cast. That's very creative. Could you tell me about I'm the- I'm just such better than you. Could you tell me? I Shut am up. the best. I am me. Could you? I am amazing. I sing so beautifully. Could you tell me about the? Yeah. You finally done now? Yeah. Thank you for that excellent, invigorating, and amazing report from someone who makes more than I will in several lifetimes. Now, our next report. Ah, oh, hashtag numpad9. Now on to our next story, which nobody actually cares about. Yeah. Hello, today we are in this, well, we are in this lovely neighborhood. We are here to ask the locals if there's been any kidnapping. Come on. I think, um, the kidnapping is very, very big loss for your um, families, especially the loved ones that have always been there for you. Has there been any kidnapping recently here? I don't think so, no. Oh, that's very good. Um, so, there's been no kidnappings. That's very good. Um, so, back to the studio. Have a lovely day. Sports. 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 Thank you very much, Polly and Alfred, for that ever the interesting news. Now, I am Tenny Spall. And I am Wicked. Welcome to fashion. Oh. We're sports. Oh. Ah. Welcome to sports. Breaking news. As you know, the Olympic season is coming quick. And a fearless woman, she is Taylor Swift has signed herself up for the 150 metre sprint. As far as we know, she has never ever done anything like this before. But when the big day comes, we'll be watching. In more relevant news, the world's smallest rugby ball, like ever, has been unveiled at a little museum in Wales. Where is that? Whoa, I'll be go see that. Anyway, that's all we have time for with sports. So, bye! The ineptitude of our in-house crew has led to us having to deploy an on-the-ground investigation crew for the weather. On to them. Fascinating. Hello, welcome to today's weather report. It will be very sunny and no chance of rain. It will be impossible. Maybe it will be possible. <laughs> Thank you very much for tuning in and watching PQA News. Sadly, we will no longer be on the air. The building is being demolished. We will find no absolution or penitence in the rubble that surrounds us. Goodbye now.